Good morning, everyone. Thank you so much for coming out today to join us on this momentous occasion. We have some great folks who have joined us and partners we'll get to uh, in my remarks. But first, I want to just call out those city council people who have joined us this morning. Uh, just raise your hand because I think we've got almost all of you. Uh, council members Nauman, Adamson, Brown, Connors, Sexer, Baden, and Palzinski are here. Oh, all standing together. Look at that. Give them a round of applause. They had a lot to do with this project. Your foresight and your hard work on this is appreciated by all. Today we're standing on the site of Splash Landing, or as many of you who grew up here might know it, Middle Pool. Over the past five years or so, under the direction of that city council I introduced to you, we've turned this site into a year-round amenity by incorporating frozen landing into the equation. When the city brought frozen landing to life some years back, we knew that we were onto something. So many of our residents now believe that frozen landing is part of the fiber of our winter activities. This site and the pool that you see behind you, more than 50 years old, and the ice rink that was initially built as a prototype to really gauge the community's interest will be growing up. Aging infrastructure, continued maintenance costs, and questions about the operations have all led the city, our partners, and ultimately this community to being here with us today. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm extremely proud to welcome you here for the groundbreaking of the landing, a public-private partnership which will feature a state-of-the-art aquatic facility and a multi-purpose ice rink where everyone will be welcome. In the coming months, you're going to see a huge transformation on this site thanks to our contractors which will lead to the opening of phase one of our new aquatic facility for the 2024 swimming season. We're excited about this new opportunity for our community and we're so grateful for the support and partnerships that we have forged along the way. Obviously this partnership and this, uh, this project could not have happened without the partners I'd like to acknowledge who are with us today. First and foremost, our financial partners, thank you so much for your investment here. And I think you all have representatives, so if you could raise your hands, we recognize you, but let's make sure everybody does. The Scott County Regional Authority. Thanks, Nance, Ken. The Regional Development Authority. Thank you, Steve. The Bechtel Trust. Scott County. Board Chair Ken Beck is here. Our community campaign donors, of which we have several here, thank you very much for your generous donations. And as of yesterday, the Enhance Iowa Board for granting us a community <clears throat> attraction and tourism grant in the amount of $790,000. Big success. <laughs> Additionally, I'd like to recognize and thank our city council for the support Recognize our staff and department heads for their hard work. Bet North Park Advisory Board, who's standing over here in the shade, they're smart. And the Landing Steering Committee. Thank you all for your efforts. Let's give them a round of applause. And finally, I want to say thank you to the YMCA of the Iowa Mississippi Valley. Thank you to Brad Martell for your stewardship, and thank you to the board for your considerable investment in our partnership. Through both financial and operational support from the YMCA, the landing project will serve our community for decades to come. We at the City of Bettendorf are forever grateful. Ready? Ready. One, two, three. <laughs> Excellent. Good job. Appreciate you. Appreciate you guys. This is going to be awesome. Yep. Thanks, Mo. Great to see you. Thanks, Brad. Yeah, thanks, guys. Appreciate you. Let's Chair, good to see you. Out of the way, let's go. Simple way, Cat. If I had known it was to take care of it, what a bad Nice job, everybody. Good choice. Oh, yeah, yeah. A little celebration. <laughs> 